Hey YouTube, um, how's it going? Today I'm going to do a demo and review video on my uh, PRI backup iron sights. As you can see I have them installed on my uh, AR pistol and I keep it like this just because I want to use this uh, thumbnail. So anyways, let's go ahead and get started and i am hand the camera off to somebody uh, while I handle the weapon. So basically, uh, this is my, there's a sight, that's how, that's how basically it looks while it's, uh, you know, on there and there's like a little front view of it. Here's a little uh, you know, side view of the side. The way you activate this sight, there's a push button that releases releases this thing and and it snaps down and it pretty pretty much um, st it stays in, in place but uh, if you want to snap it back up you just push the button and hold it and hold it in place um, let me show you the activation button okay. so this is the button on here you just push that button and snap it down and push the button and lock it into place. You uh, lock it. You lock it onto the rail with this bolt. Um, it's really good quality. And um, let me show you how to adjust it. Basically, um, you would just turn this knob, okay, and then that would turn. That would adjust this piece, you know, left or right. So it has a, uh, a long range. It has long range, short range, and uh, if you, as you adjust this left and right, it moves the item left and right. So there's just your uh, windage. So this is basically the rear, and it locks down pretty nice. You see it, it clears the, um, the charging handle. Let's not, uh, let's not load these in. So. So as you can see, you just put your fingers on here and you got plenty of room. I got a badger latch on mine, but you got plenty of room to to, lack, to rack it and it really stays out of the way. It's very tactical and it looks, uh, it looks pretty nice. Um, I'm going to do the front now. The front sight is the PR sight and um, I believe it's got the HK <laughs> full round aperture and um, this also with a push button just push button put it down and it stays you know down and out of the way it's very uh, very tactical and low profile and uh, I, I like it a lot on my gun and I think it looks really nice same deal when you want to raise it up can't raise it up all the way because you still have to there's these locking pins that won't let you to go all the way up but you push this button and lock it in place and that won't move if you want to adjust it you just get a standard um, uh, sight tool adjustment I don't know if you can see that in there I don't know if there's any enough light but there's a uh, you can see in there there's a sight tool uh, to be able to adjust it in there so basically that would raise that would raise this sight post up this little sight post up and be able to that's for your um, your elevation adjustment. It's a really solid uh, sight. I've uh, been using it for about uh, three months now. I've got about 1500 rounds through it and it, it really really works well and I like how uh, smooth it is and it really looks nice on the rifle. So that's basically my review. Um, I bought them for about about 60 bucks a piece at a gun show and very happy with them so I'm going to put this guy back in and we will end there's my uh, it's my Tiffany trigger by the way skeleton trigger it's got a three pound uh, pull and it's absolutely fantastic uh, that I'll leave for another video 
but for now I will end on this thanks a lot and I hope you guys have a, a good day